Thanks for checking out Clever TV. Dana Ward here with Jocelyn Davis. Hello, everyone. And we are so stoked because this weekend is the Teen Choice Awards. One of the best award shows every year, hands Totally, down. and of course we're going to be on the carpet and then we're going to be back here in the studio giving you guys all the deets you need to know. But right now we have a very special edition of the show. We're actually breaking down some predictions. And we're going to kick it off right now with Choice Movie Lip Lock. That was for you guys. Hopefully you heard that. So first in this category, we have Zac Efron and Taylor Schilling for their kiss in The Lucky One. Ah. Mm -hmm. Jennifer Lawrence and Josh Hutcherson for The Hunger Games. Kristen Stewart and Robert Pattinson, The Twilight Saga Breaking Dawn Part 1. Emma Stone and Ryan Gosling for Crazy Stupid Love. And rounding out the category, we have Channing Tatum and Rachel McAdams in The Vow. Oh my goodness. These are all great kisses. They are, and they're all incredibly attractive people, which I feel like takes it to the next level. Totally. Makes the kiss that much better. It's so true, it's so true. And all of these people had such great chemistry. Maybe personally, oh, but definitely them, yes. as characters. And something I love about this category this year in particular is that there are all genres represented as far as movies go. So you have a little bit of drama, you have some comedy, mm -hmm. you have some romance kind of have a little bit of everything going on. Completely. So it's a good depiction. Completely. Oh my goodness. But it's such a tough choice. Who are you going to go with? Have you made a decision? Oh my goodness. A prediction decision? I have not made a prediction decision yet. Um, okay. I know. Okay. Do you know? I think I know. One, two, three, go. All right. One, two, three. The Kristen vow. Kristen and Robert. Mm. Okay. So you're going with Breaking <laughs> Dawn part one. Yes, I'm going with them, uh, with Kristen and Robert, simply because they obviously, obviously have really strong chemistry. They met on the set of Twilight. They're still dating many movies later. I mean, so it's real. It's kind it's of a an, real lip lock, you guys. But don't you think it's kind of an unfair advantage that they're already like basically in love in real life? That I mean, they get to like mac down for their job. Perhaps it's an unfair advantage, but it doesn't matter because. It's true. It's an advantage if, I mean, they're going to win anyways. That's true. Anyways. I guess, but I kind of disagree because I'm going to go with The Vow. It was, I die for movies like this where you go in knowing you're going to be completely hysterical, but with the hope that everything is going to work out okay. And I love Rachel McAdams and Channing Tatum, not too shabby, going to throw that out there. And I just thought this was such a sweet story and yeah. for, I don't want to give away the story for people who haven't seen the movie but their kisses were so sweet. They were. Yeah, so that's my vote, but I'd be glad to see any of these people win. And I guess it's interesting with the vow because they had several different kisses throughout. Mm -hmm. And at different because, places for their for their yeah. characters. and So that is interesting. So they that had to go into the scene into a, a different mindset. It wasn't like we're in love the whole time. It's, it was a different situation for each kiss. So I'm just throwing that out there, guys. That's, Keep that in mind. That's true. But then, I mean, the lucky one is also based on a Nicholas Sparks uh, novel. Right, so right, right. So it's equally romantic. Right. And then we've got the Hunger Games. Which I like They're that kissing kiss. for their lives. They're kissing to survive, yeah. people. Kiss or get the kiss or of die. death. Okay. Yes. Kiss or get the kiss of death. That's what happened. Kiss. That's what's happening. And they did not eat the berries. They people. did not eat the berries, They didn't people. eat the berries Night at lock, the end, so that is love. Mm -hmm, it is. So, I mean, you can tell we're very passionate about this category. And but. Crazy Stupid Love. Oh, Great kiss how did I forget about Emma that? And Ryan, too. Two amazing actors. <laughs> so, it's anyone's game. So, your vote goes to The Vow. My vote goes to The Vow. And I'm breaking Dawn Part 1. Okay. What about you guys? Right. Yeah, leave a comment below and let us know who you're voting for. And, of course, keep it here at Clever TV to find out who actually wins the 2012 Teen Choice Award for this category. Best movie lip lock. Mwah. Kisses. Mwah. All right, guys, thanks so much for tuning in. I'm Dana Ward with Jocelyn Davis, and we'll see you soon. Bye, Bye. guys.